High above the Andes Mountains, soaring scavengers keep a watchful eye on the ground. Andean condors, with their 10-foot wingspan, can effortlessly cover hundreds of miles in a day. But when a meal is spotted, they descend in droves. The carcass of a guanaco, a wild relative of the llama, lies exposed to the elements. A gray fox gets to the carcass first, but not soon enough. Dwarfed by the condor's bulk, the little gray fox will have to wait its turn, but there will be little left when the condors are finished. Adult males weigh in at 25 pounds and will quickly reduce the carcass to a skeleton. The condors are attracted not only to life's end, but also its beginning. Stillborn calves or afterbirths are a welcome source of food. Temperatures in the Andes can be extreme. A baby guanaco born late in the day dies from the cold. There is nothing the distressed mother can do. The condors will hang on the wind until the baby is still. But its mother is hesitant about defending it. Perhaps she's intimidated by the condor's impressive bulk. Before the birds can get their fill, the mother chases them away. Feathers unruffled, they take to the skies. As the undertakers of the air, another meal always awaits them.